Hello. 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 I am Pickle Frank, and I play bass guitar, and I also play a little bit of keyboards and squeeze box. I am Pickle Paul, and I play guitar and harmonica and some other instruments. I'm Mark. Pickle, Mark that is, or Bongo, as many of my associates referred to me as. Uh, I would say it's, a, it's an event that you could bring your whole family to. Anybody under 108. We've even had high school uh, kids come out and see us. Our music it doesn't really talk down to the, to the youngers, to, so it's hard to put an age on it. We play the type of music that we think uh, not only kids but the parents would love and I know that's uh, kind of a cliche in today's music industry but it is absolutely the truth. We have a bunch of pets between us and actually, you know, dogs kind of like us too. We happen to be friends, we happen to like making music and writing songs and then when we started this kids band. There was no rhyme or reason to it. It was just a pure expression of uh, pickle-ology. <laughs> Paul and I met in college. Um, actually, Paul uh, taught me how to play guitar, Pickle Paul, and uh, it was probably a pretty good investment for him. I met Mark um, at a, uh, I was in a band in the 1990s. We just each had a daughter. Each, each of our wives had a daughter. We have, let's see, um, 12 kids between uh, the three of us. Uh, so we were making a CD for them, and um, we said we need a name for the band. And I think we thought of it in about five minutes. We think of D. Yeah. Um, R. Yes. Really, what it is, we have three individual people that are part of the band. Everyone brings kind of their own flair to the song, and uh, you know, usually one of the guys comes with an idea and then brings it to the other two and we mix it up all together and kind of come out with a song. The best songs I've written have started with my kids singing some song and I say, oh wait, let me record that. <laughs> okay, got it guys, okay. One, two, three, oh wait, forgot to hit, got to play. Ready, yeah, one, two, got it. get some click. We, uh, probably unlike a lot of different bands, um, happen to play a song maybe once or twice and it winds up on the album. And then I record it and I make it into a pickle song. That's usually how it happens, seriously. Okay, ready? One, two, three, four. You know? uh, usually our first uh, take of a lot of these songs is uh, just has the energy that we like to do. We do a little bit of overdubs, but um, it's pretty, uh, pretty out there. And that's pretty much how it goes. Pizza song is definitely one of my favorite songs. We do a lot of song about food. We try to make them, well, no, we don't try to make them catchy. They come out being very catchy. Catchy, yes, and uh, especially if you're hungry. Uh, you know, that one has definitely, uh, you know, an edge to it, uh, a punkness to it. Um, that is a lot of our background, and we definitely love to inject some punk rock music into the youth of America anytime we get a chance. I, you know, I always wondered, how many kids got pizza that night because I said, you know, PIZZA! We kind of focus on uh, two main places. We like to play outside a lot. We get to run around when we get to play outside a lot. Uh, we do a lot of festivals. We also do a lot of performing arts centers. We have an indoor show. They uh, uh, let us play in front of kids indoors as we well. We actually do a little skit in our indoor shows. Usually yes. we can't do that on the outside because we don't have the stage. We do a lot of uh, charity work for the uh, Children's Hospital of uh, Philadelphia. Somebody's sad and you make them happy. Whew. That's fantastic. We've played in ma major concerts in front of thousands of thousands of seats. You will definitely have a lot of fun at a Paisley Pickle show, but there has never been a Paisley Pickle show that has been the same as the one before. Sun's coming out, it's really good. My favorite song to perform is probably Be a Very Nice Plant. I like pizza song. Pickle Boogie. Pickle Boogie because everybody gets up and dance and we show them a little dance and it's pretty funny. Like preschool punk or something. Um, that just seems to be one that 
gets a lot of reaction from the kids and uh, gets kind of us going. We usually play that uh, toward the beginning of the set and it's uh, you know all downhill from there. They get so excited and they are in, uninhibited and they dance and they're easy to feed off of because it's, it's such pure good energy. Oh, I can't think of a, of a best aspect of performing for kids. We absolutely love it. Watching kids be happy, watching anybody be happy for that matter, but just playing and expressing what I was given to do for the world. The three of us are, you know, we're not the most serious of people and we like to have, uh, you know, lots of fun on stage. The best is when you're outside and somebody comes up and says, oh, you're pickleball! And I say, yes! And they, you know, sometimes they ask for an autograph. But sometimes they just explode, like, oh, yeah! they can't believe you know, they see me in regular clothes. The energy that we get from them, the pureness of their reaction to us, it just is the most wonderful thing uh, we could ever do. We're very, very lucky to be in a position to do this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that, um, that's what they do. <laughs> Oh, we are having a fabulous time. We get to go on stage and we get to be little kids. How much cooler could that be? Well, let me say, you know, like, I was a pickle. I really, really do enjoy the expression, uh, the ability to express my inner child. We love playing music. We're best of friends and we just love what we're doing. And to like just play as a child again, I think this is very good for my ego and my whole well built. Of course I love being a pickle! It is the coolest thing I think I've ever done in my life. I've played a lot of music. I've done a lot of uh, collaboration. I've been in the music industry for a long time. And this is the most fun I've ever had in my life with music. So it has been wonderful. <laughs> Well, we all have seven legs, and we have great big antennae that come out at night with our long tongues, and we eat bugs. We still have a, a little bit of, um, you know, spontaneity in our uh, in our music. Uh, that will never disappear, and that's I think something that sets us a little bit apart. Good looking, uh, uh, talented. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, a little bit of that, I think. Yeah, yes. Sort of. I mean, if, if, I mean, if you took it, if you he's, like from one, he is, he it, you know, some dysfunction. people say, but you know, I'm, I'm not sure I agree. But you know, if it's you could say, but I don't agree with that at all. Exactly. And I, I have to do nothing but concur. I like uh, sweet pickles fried. They're so good. They don't do it much in this area. I don't know what the problem is here in New Jersey, Philadelphia area, but they should, somebody should pick up on that. So um, you heard it here first. Uh, if, um, if that happens, uh, some place is going to make a lot of money. I actually hate pickles. I run from pickles every time I see them. I don't like the way they taste and honestly it kind of offends me when people eat them. I don't know, to tell you the truth right there. That <laughs> there's too too deep for me. I just like to be me and get out there and play drums, to tell you the truth. Because <laughs> I'm probably the craziest thing I've ever seen. But that's because they have to get me back to the hospital very quickly after the show, so, you know. I would like to get some pizza after this set. What, what do you pizza think? Pizza would be nice. I like to go by planes, trains, and automobiles. Yes, to any place that'll have In us. all serious snow, uh, snow uh, there is serious snow, I think. There is but snow. in serious snow, snow yes. in it's August. I love snow. Yes. Well, we made a video that was so randomly done, but it turned out awesome. Again, it involved uh, a lot of our, our kids, our friends' kids. Uh, they were in the video, and it was just uh, a spontaneous combustion, and it was really funny as anything. Uh, we have three CDs. We did a CD. Um, called uh, Pickleheads in 2009. Uh, we did a second CD in 2010 called Picklehead Platter. And we've just released our third CD this year called Superheroes. And it's a, um, a themed CD that uh, probably our best work yet. I happen to be Captain Smarty Pants. That means he outwits the criminals when we go into yes. this thing. I'm the smart one. And, uh, you know, we also like to uh, sponsor superheroes in your community. Um, you know, that's something that we feel is, uh, you know, really important. And, you know, kind of the little things that you do really mean a lot um, to the greater good. I am 
Super Bongo. So I just... You know. These are not so secret weapon. All the press that we've gotten, all of the feedback that we've gotten, the people that we attract, uh, we seem to have a, a special niche there that is differentiating ourselves. And I am Dr. Daydream. I think of all the answers and then I can't remember usually. Hey, but it's, it's still, so every once in a while one comes to the surface and I, yes. He confuses them. Yes. Uh, I think the, uh, you know, the sky's the limit really. I mean, uh, I think it, uh, things have just kind of be, uh, happened for us over the last couple of years. Mm -hmm. Hopefully they'll continue to happen. I think it's really up to our fans and up to us and, uh, you know, um, be a pickle head. We have played at big places and small places. I would like to continue playing at big places and small places. And we would yes. all like our personal pickle barrels to maybe get a little bit bigger. Money um, does not bring meaning. It yeah. is the energy the, that the, lifts me or lifts me up see, or something like that. Yes. A smile is better than a dollar bill. <laughs> like Put that, that in your pipe and smoke it. <laughs> yeah, but don't smoke. Okay. No, so don't smoke that. Just remember that, that a smile is better than a dollar bill. If that be your, oh, mantra for life. We don't, we don't let him talk very much, yeah, usually, I yes. He thinks too much. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. Oh. <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> All right, nice, yeah. Okay, uh, adios. <laughs>